Mamu kwa hivu unaniambiaje mamu? Hii ni mesaji kani nimepata hivi. Naweza simamisha kwa watu ati wewe ni bwana wangu. Sasa wakiita kila mtu aende na bwana yake naweza naendanga na huyo. Mamu unaendanga na huyo. Mamu unaendanga na huyo. Kwa hivyo hizo mwaka zote kama nakana wewe unandanganya. 20 years mamu kama niko na wewe mamu unandanganya. Ni venye tu nilizalisha. Ah ni wewe nilizalisha ni wako. Lakini nimerevuka. Nikaona kumbe nilitupa mbao. Nilikuwa fala. Sasa hivi nimechangu. Mamu mbao nilitupa mamu utaokota hiyo mbao. Mamba watu uko sana. Lakini ye tuliko sana kanionyesha madarao kafanya nini akaenda nikalia kwa barabara sana nililia ja uone mwenye mpenda kama nakuacha hiyo design lazima utoe machozi wa nasikia sahi kama nimepumzika because watu wengi nimeona mkiniuliza why is tano Why are you not bringing us what we want? James Amalova. What you don't know guys is the work we do behind the scenes. The work we have done to get this man. Sijui nitasema ni nini. So, me I thought it was just a normal way of getting him because what we usually do, wacha nimpe siri tu kidogo, immediately we sanitize someone tunajuanga tu penye tumemsanitizea high chances ametoka tu within the same locality so what we did after sanitizing him he left his wife uh, Winfred left so we were left me and the crew within no time tukajaribu kumtrace tujaribu tumtafute akuje tuonge tuonge at least tusikie kama anaweza to pay his side of the story ama at least tupate Winfred atupe his side of the story you know what ladies and gentlemen we went door to door we couldn't find him immediately after around we, we thought he would reach us to we would reach to us complaining about the video uh, maybe after some days but the guy didn't reach out to, out to us so what we did we formed a committee sijuni yaita a shepherd a committee of shepherds ama committee ya nani walikuwa natembea na unajua ni Nairobi wanatembea door by door door by door door by door with his picture and his wife's picture but you know what the first week ikaisha seven days we dispatched a group of three men ambao tulikuwa tunawalipa daily basis lakini hawakupata hata siku moja tukazunguka 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 the first week imeisha the second week imeisha third week the three good men siji kama wako around wakuje to to appear a word of a pros men these gentlemen have worked to get this man wamefanya kazi wamengangana wamengangana mpaka now to yesterday yesterday is the day to mepata James Amalova mimi sijui ni sema nini kwa sababu nilikuwa na i was feeling i was having mzigo ambao nilikuwa nimebeba na mzigo ni ku deliver what you guys have been sending me because you guys reached out to me most of you concerning him ukiniambia stano we would love to hear from this guy we would love to help him you understand so what i did mimi nimengangana ladies and gentlemen if there was a price i remember it was on a sunday we were me the uh, the crew uh, security my director to be dispatched in three groups of three people three on a sunday because sunday we knew is the day that we were off ambao hatukwa hatukwa tumeshikana sana so <laughs> security at the end side ya ya dandora mimi nilienda saidi ya Kasarani actually specific pale panaitwa Getuamba and my director alienda pale kunaitwa Rakisama because this man tulimpata within the same locality hapo penye tunawaambia but good luck tulimpata jana mzee mzima <laughs> nimekutafuta <laughs> there is no other person nishaimutafuta design nimekutafuta <laughs> ulipatikana nilipatikana aha kuna siku nilipatana na vijana watatu 
wakani wakanitafuta wakaniambia Jemo James uh-huh. unatafuta unatafutwa sana uh-huh. hata tumefanya vizuri kukupata uh-huh. wakaniuliza James kwani una simu uh-huh. <laughs> nikamwambia niko na simu uh-huh. lakini shida namba yangu si kupeana yeah. hey, wakaniambia kuna jamaa anaitwa Pasta So yeah. amekutafuta kabisa uh-huh. Nikamwambia oh amenijua. Hata leo nimeku nimefurahi sana vile tumepatana. <laughs> Kama Mungu alisema tutapatana tumepatana leo. Eh, lakini kwani niulize? Mm. Sitaki nikuulize penye unaishi kwa sababu sitaki kuambia hapa penye unaishi. Mm. Lakini mimi penye tulipatana I thought nitakupata within the area. Mm. But sijui kama ni mpango wa shetani ama ni mpango wa Mungu for the first time and this thing yenye ambayo usifanyangi sana eh? si kuchukua namba yako in most cases nikipatana na client the time ananipea simu yake huwa anaji flash kwanza mm-hmm. umeelewa uh-huh. na kama hana credit na reverse call kwa namba yangu so that akitoka kwa show mimi mwenyewe naweza mpigia direct ni mconvince but sijui kama ni because of ya case ilikuwa very unique si kwa nimepatana nayo i didn't do anything for real na mimi the first thing napatanga nikipata na client ni kuji reverse call ama na jifresh kwa simu yangu mm-hmm. either imezima nitapata i tried calling you kama iko on i find a missed call and nitasave namba yako mm-hmm. so that next time kukupata itakuwa ni rahisi mm-hmm. kama si hivyo najuanga unakuanga within the same locality lakini kwako haikufanyika hivyo mm-hmm. i'm feeling disappointed <laughs> Ndio ah. hiyo ilikuwa bahati mbaya. Uh-huh. Jata ile siku nilikuwa nadhani umechukua hata ya mama. Uh-huh. Sababu siku kumbuka hata nikupea yangu. Mm. Eh hata niliuliza mama kama alichukua namba yako, mama kaniambia ah aku hata yeye alisahau kuchukua. Uh-huh. Eh lakini bahati nzuri nimekupata. Uh-huh. Hawa watu wanafaa nipigie makofi. Kukupata. Eh, <laughs> <laughs> It was one of the hellest. Uh-huh. Hellest work ever to do. Kukupata but good luck tumekupata ukiwa mzima so james i would now st- i would wish we start the whole thing eh mm-hmm. ebu nieleze more about you james mm-hmm. safari yako ya 20 years wewe na winfred uh-huh. venye ilianza hata before ianze mm-hmm. eh, kuna swali ambao watu kila mtu anajiuliza nitakuja nikikuuliza tu polepole pole, eh? mm-hmm. lakini kwanza nieleze safari yako na winfred ilianzaje mm-hmm. safari yangu na mama tulipatana na mama <laughs> nikikuwa zoezi jamii upande yangu nimependa mambo ya sport kabisa kuna wakati nilikuwa nacheza na acrobatic town sasa ikaenda ikaenda hivyo alafu huko saiza kasarani pia nilikuwa nimependa kwenda kucheza ball <laughs> sasa Mata kidogo unacheza na ball eh ball nacheza na ah, hebu simama <laughs> kwanza pole <laughs> ngoja kidogo unacheza na ball <laughs> <laughs> football are we talking about football man in netball mimi nachezanga football uh-huh. and nilianza kama niko shule hiyo kitu nimependa kabisa hadi wa leo bado niko hivi bado nacheza football unacheza football hata ukitupea ball hivi <laughs> unaweza stuka <laughs> <laughs> like for real nachezanga football nachezanga football hata hapa grau yetu inaitwa tomboya hapa uh-huh. dandora tu hapa eh hata kwa sasa hii bado inatengenezwa lakini bado tunacheza football kwa kiwanja iko kando yake mm-hmm. eh ni unacheza football kabisa sasa football kabisa nimesikia pia ukisema unafanya zoezi zoezi nafanyanga hata huku ngambo kuna mlima tunaendanga kukimbia kila asubuhi saa moja tukapo kwa mlima hata huko tulipatanga mama kama tunafanya naye zoezi huko. Naomba tuketi. Naomba tuketi this kuchoshi. Aya ya ya ya. You know I'm feeling challenged. Eh? So, umesema unafanya unacheza football, mm-hmm. unacheza acrobatics, Acrobatic. unapanda milima ukikimbia. Uh-huh. How do you Sasa do upande ya kwa saa hii mm-hmm. bado nimekosa tu mwenye anaweza nishikilie mkono. Mm-hmm. Mimi nimesoma body fitness. Oh. Eh hata zoezi na anaweza kuchapia vizuri sana. Hata ah. <laughs> hata ikitambia yako ah. inaweza rudi kwa flat kabisa. Niwe <laughs> <laughs> na six packs. <laughs> by, by the way, hiyo body fitness 
ka nilikuwa na cheza acrobatic sasa kuja vile miaka ina songa na hii vitu zetu za kukula bada saa zingine unakosa hata kitu nakula sasa inabidi upunguze kidogo hata hii mambo yangu ya football sasa hii bado na trade ile ya body fitness tu ya saa zingine unafanya na bado hujapata bado ya pata mwenye na kushikilia mkono mm. lakini bado naomba tu Mungu anipe nguvu niendelee kufanya hizo vitu nafanya mm-hmm. siku moja anionyesha njia mm. eh. so eh, asante sana kwa kutaja hayo maneno eh. mm. i want now we get direct to the point Mm. Let me ask you this question eh? mm. You know tukifanyanga interview kama hizi saa zingine huwa tuna feel mm-hmm. that we are feeling for you but I pray Mungu atanisaidia I ask the appropriate questions eh? mm. Were you born this way James mm? Were you born this way About uh, ulizaliwa hivi Hapana Hii hii nakumbuka vizuri hii ilikuwa polio na hii polio ilinipika kama ni kuna 18 years Oh. Eh, before 18 ulikuwa sawa. Nilikuwa sawa <laughs> hata ya ile ile nitoka kwa shule. Je, niliweka chini sana. Uh-huh. Eh, before nilikuwa hivi kwanza nilikuwa footballer. Hata nilikuwa mtegemeo kwa shule yetu. Hadi nilikuwa nachezaka football na fresh, uh, watu wengi. Sasa vile li, hii ilikuwa polio. Hata nakumbuka je, ile nilipika kama naona. Mm. Siku moja nilikuwa nalala usiku kitu saini usiku hivyo. Mm. Nasikia tu guu side moja imekwama. Imekwama na nichuku siwezi beba juu. Mm-hmm. Sasa ne, hiyo siku yote nilikuwa nalea tu kufika asubuhi nikamwambia baba baba, eh hey, mguu, hii mguu. Baba akajaribu kama yeye mzazi. Aka alikuwa nadhani ni ile ya kawaida. Mm. Aka nipeleka hospitali nikadungwa sindano. Bado akaleta ile wale wale, wale madaktari wa kienyeji wakaguzaguza mwishowe nikajipata niko hivyo mm. sasa vile nilikuwa vile nilijipata niko hivyo hadi wa leo sijai lose hope kimaisha sasa zile vitu nilikuwa nafanyanga before ni kwa hivi hadi wa leo hakuna kitu nime change bado nafanya hadi wa leo mm-hmm. tena sasa hii hata ile rudi ilibidi sasa nirudi tena kwa shule niendelee na shu, shule nika rudi kwa shule hata kwa shule nilikuwa na cheza football ama kila kitu watoto tulikuwa na wengi sana kwa shule sasa mwalimu yetu pia alikuwa ananifurahisha sana mwalimu yetu akwa amenibeba mimi ni kuna mgu moja ama ni nini kila kila mtoto kitu anafanya hata vile alikuwa anafanya hata kama ni kiboko <laughs> mwalimu alikuwa amekanyaga chini <laughs> anakuwa alikuwa ananiambia wewe usitumie jina mbaya tu wewe nikiwete wewe sikiwete mm-hmm. eh kama ni kuokota makaratasi utaokota eh but mwalimu alinionyesha njia poa hadi sasa hii hiyo power mwalimu alinipea bado ni kunayo hadi wa leo eh sasa ni fry sana tena na wewe mwalimu Now, eh mkipata na Winfield mm. ulikuwa hivi eh nilikuwa hivi uh-huh. nilikuwa hivi ya tangu nimpate sasa tu for 20 years mm-hmm. eh sasa hii nilipata kama ah nimemaliza shule nimeshaanza kuwa sol sasa by then tukapatana kama niko hivyo mm. then you decide to date like for how long before mwingie sasa into the marriage eh huyo eh, <laughs> Umejua sisi wanaume unaweza unaweza pata hata mama uko nayo sasa <laughs> zingine umepata mlipatana kwa disco matanga vitu kama hizo unaona mm. but wewe wangu nilipatana naye mali nafanya ngazoezi kwa mlima je tulikuwa tunafanya ngazo naye mlima sasa zingine anakimbia kwa mlima ananiona ananamfurahisha mbaya sana eh sasa tangu tu pata, tupatane na yeye sasa hii kitu tumeka kitu 5 months before ni muwa before eh, okay. sasa mama tulikuwa tuna anakuja na nitembelea ananifulia nguo saa zingine ananipeleka kwa sista yake ananiambia we kaka mmejo huyu ni simeji yako mm-hmm. <laughs> by the way alikuwa ananifurahisha mm-hmm. sasa nikaona huyu mama vile niko hivi saa zingine nimetoka kazi nimechoka kama nimerudi napata mama amenifulia abenewekea chakula hapo hata kama ni chai strong tea hapo na kunywa sasa nilikuwa na jiongelesha kiro huyu mama ananifurahisha sana 
sasa nikakaa siku moja nikamwambia brother yangu brother kuna mtoto nimepata hapo bwana ni kitu <laughs> natamani siku moja ukuje msalamie nikapiga mama simu mama saa tu utakuwa akaniambia saa tu haoni kama atakuwa lakini atakuwa sande oh kitu sanga pivi sana sana 9:09 bas kama utakuwa ya brother yangu anatamani kukuona <laughs> sawa brother yangu alinipigia simu akaniambia anakuja nikamwambia mama hebu pika hata chai eh hey, hiyo siku hata siku nimejipanga upoje kama uko na mgeni saa zingine <laughs> lazima kuwa na kitu kidogo hata kama mama abai hata maziwa pikie simu yake siku na kitu nikamwambia mama mama fanya hivi pika strong tea na mandazi tatu uweke sipeji yako afanye nini akule mimi mm. nitajikaza kama mwanaume jaza sasa nitafanyaje ili mgeni akule na sisi tukaenja nja mama kaskia kumbe mama pia alikuwa mama mzuri alikuwa amejipanga akaenda akapika shopping akabai maziwa akabai bluba na mkate mimi nilikaa chini na bro yangu tunapika story kama nadhani ni ile strong tea ndio inakuja Eh hey, nilistuka kama mama ameleta mkate bwana. <laughs> Ali ni fresh aje. Sasa tumekana brother yangu chini. Sasa tumeanza kuongea nikamwambia bro. Bro wewe unasemeje yako? Mimi sijai yoa. Nataka ni, akai kwa nyumba. Umeonaje? Brother yangu amefanya. Alifanya hivi akafry akaniambia bro hiyo kitu umefanya umefanya kitu ya maana sana. Semeji. Ehe akamwambia semeji yangu jina yake semeji pia nini? Akamwambia bibi yangu jina, bibi yangu pia akamwambia jina yake aka fry sana bibi yangu akamwambia sasa semeji hii sasa ni nyumba yangu kuanzia saa hii hakuna siku tanikosa hapa sasa vile nimeingia na sitoki na sitatoka hadi wa leo hajatoka mm. mm. until ile siku tulipatana nyinyi yeah. so eh, kutoka ile day yenye tulikuwa na wewe kama naweza kumbuka vizuri mm. it's, all mo- it's almost heading to three weeks eh, mm. eh mumeonana na Winfred na mama ehe ehe ile siku mama alirudi kwa sisake vile tuliwachana alirudi kwa sisake uzuri alinipeleka kwa sisake ya kwanza before ni muawe akane akamwambia sisake ati mimi ni semeji yake sasa kwa hivyo sisake alikuwa amenijua sasa vile aliniacha nilipigia sisake simu ya kwanza akushika. Siku ya pili alishika. Nikamuuliza sisako habari ya sisako, sisako alitoka kwa nyumba akaniacha akaenda. Ako wapi? Akaniambia sisake ako nayo hapo. Oh, ako nayo hapo. Siku mfecha nilimwambia vile sisake ananifanyia. Ile tuliko sana akaniita niende kwake huyo semeji yangu sasa. Mm-hmm. Nikaenda kwa semeji yangu tukaongea. Nikamwambia semeji nyumba watu uko sana. Lakini ye tuliko sana akanionyesha madharau akafanya nini akaenda. Nikalia kwa barabara sana nililia ja uone mwenye umependa kama na kuacha hiyo design lazima utoe machozi. Mm. Sasa tuliongea tuliongea tukatengeneza mambo hadi sister yake alikuja na yeye kwangu. Mhm. Kuku... Mm-hmm. Mm, kuk... before akuja kwako, mm. kuna point yenye nataka kuelewa hapa hivi kwanza jemu eh. Mm. Ni wewe ulimkosea mani hadi kukosea. Yeye yeye alinikosea. Mm. Yeye alinikosea je message niliona kwa simu zake iko ni fraisha. Mm. Sasa kumuuliza akanivuruga. Sasa nikamuuliza mam kama we ndio umenikosea na bado unaniongeleza vibaya design hivi. Yeye yeah, akarusha mkono akafanya nini? Akaenda. Sasa kuenda vile nilimfuata kwa sisake, sisake akaniambia jioni anakuja kwa nyumba ni mgoje. Nikamgoja akakuja naye kuja na yeye sisake akatengeneza katikati mimi na yeye e, akampoint sana akamwambia wewe wewe ni mkunakosa 
Okay, hebu kwanza nielewe. Mm. Sister Kelly aliona ile video yenye ilikuwa inaenea kwa sababu hiyo video ime trend sana mtandaoni. Aliona. Eh, sister yake mm. aliona hiyo video sababu hata kukuja vile alikuja kwangu na huyo sasa yake akamvuruka mbele ya mbele yangu alimwambia vizuri ati wewe umeamua umependa James akaniuliza James umempenda akamwambia mimi nimempenda kabisa sababu niko na yeye hadi wa leo sijamfukuza ndio ayuko kwako kwa saa hii ayuko kwangu mm-hmm. mm. Aya utakuja kutuambia bado ni kwa nini hayuko kwako eh? mm. Lakini James nikikuuliza mko na watoto. Mm. Si ndio? Yeah. Watoto wanasomaje sofa? Watoto? Watoto wenu wewe na Winifred. Mm. Wanasema nini? Sasa watoto moja mkubwa aliniuliza baba wapi mama? Nikamwambia umeja mkikosana kwa nyumba uwezi mwambie mtoto kweli inafaa mtoto mtoto hata katikati yenu we na mama haifai mtoto ajue nikamwambia mama ametoka lakini atarudi tu kila siku mtoto hata jana usiku mtoto alinuliza hmm? mtoto alinuliza ati baba baba wapi mama ilibidi nimpigie simu nipigie mama simu mama hebu ongee na ongee na mtoto wako akaniambia wacha kunisumbua. Ya kwanza alinijibu hivyo akakata simu. Kukata simu asubuhi nilimpigia simu, akaniambia fanya hivi. Nitakuja saa nane lakini usinivuruge. Leo nikamwambia mama, mimi sina ubaya na wewe, rudi kwako kwa nyumba uangalie watoto. Hata saa hii nitoka asubuhi sijarudi kwa nyumba siji kama amerudi. Hmm. Hmm. Kutoka hiyo siku ajaye rudi, kutoka hiyo siku ajaye rudi. Okay. So niko na mgeni hapa hmm. ambaye ningependa aje tu. Si ndio? Hmm. Haya. Wacha akuje. 